All right, you guys, welcome back to yet another edition of Peaches to Beaches. If you guys are not familiar with Peaches to Beaches, it's basically just a huge 100 mile plus radius of uh, garage sales. And it's like you go into in, uh, certain cities, they have like little vendors, they have professional vendors, you got regular garage sellers, that type of stuff. And you just go out there and you source, and it's kind of an all day event, and it's pretty awesome. So, this is the second clip uh, of the Peaches to Beaches trip, but however, it was actually only our third stop, which is pretty wild. So, uh, yeah, with that being said, subscribe like comment and let's get into the video y'all do like storage units or anything uh, I'm a hustle. <laughs> I would say I respect that. Uh-huh. <laughs> and he had nothing but old new stock. He had a contract with Sears. Oh wow. Coles, Dillers, JC Penny. So a lot of this and Radio Shack. So a lot of this yeah. stuff is just old new stock that you can't right. find anymore right right when they actually made stuff to last yeah <laughs> you got that right <laughs> nowadays you use something for about 10 minutes and it's broke broke <laughs> are these the game stuff you're talking about yeah, oh some yeah of them. oh some of them <laughs> some of it <laughs> i got nes i got super nintendo i got Wii's. i got uh, yeah, I got one game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, you hold on to that. Oh, well, yeah. Absolutely. You want me to put this over there with other games? Oh yeah. <laughs> gotcha. <clears throat> that the last tote? Yes, my Okay, gotcha. Yeah, we got a YouTube channel as well and we uh What's your channel? The Georgia Faker? Huh. I think I've seen watching before. Have you? Yeah. <laughs> awesome. You uh uh, chase after the right place. Yeah, yeah. Um, trying to think some of the other people. But yeah, I think I've definitely stopped coming. You know what I'm saying? A couple times. Yeah. What's your heavy hitters you fought before? That's what I be watching. Uh, well, I do a lot of storage units, and uh, we uh, found a unit for about 450 bucks, filled with snap-on tools to the Starrett micrometer set that goes for $3,800. It's crazy what you find out there, man. <laughs> It is crazy. This might be a little heavy. Nah, I got it. You good. Appreciate it, man. I'm yep. gonna kill him. Yeah, you good. Something like that. <laughs> Alright, man. Have fun. Yeah. <laughs> that might not be good. Yeah. It might be a couple of bangs in there, but I don't think it will. Boonies. Now, there's a. Uh, now, there's some stuff in here. There's a. Uh, Something, oh, there's a controller down there. There's some, there's some stuff in there. I mean, is there, is there a deal for it all? Just, uh, no, not to put no pressure on you, you know. I mean, I want to, but I kind of know that that's going to draw a lot of people. Right, right. I understand. I just figured I ask. How about you look through it and you tell me what you can do with? If not, uh, the price that you say I don't like, then we just, you can just stop back by. Right. And get through going through it. Gotcha. Oh. Huh? Uh, I do do Pokemon. I do. I do a little bit of everything. I'm one of those uh people who like to buy a little bit of everything. I don't like to stick to one thing. You 
You ain't got no price in mind? I hate to look through all this. <laughs> but, I also, but I also understand what you're saying, you know, it brings people in. So just get all of it, I'm about to be at another like 25. 2500 for one i know it's over 500 games right right and then i got all the different consoles you, know, you get five dollars a piece out right of right games. yeah no that's a that's a good deal and you got some sealed ones in there uh a little bit of everything Somebody, this one where's that uh that 08 with uh kevin durant Is it with the Sega, the Adobe? I don't know. If it is, it's in the green bag in the truck. Uh, I don't think it's with that one. That's probably the one that's with the green Gotcha. The big one? Uh, yeah, the, the bug mailer one. Okay. Yeah. It's a little bit of everything. Yeah. You okay, if I cut. You okay, if I cut this up, okay. okay. No, not all of them. Not all of them. Not all of them. Not all of them. Oh, you got hats in here? Yeah. Oh, new hats. Let's see. That's not, That's not it either. We. There's one with all the uh, NES games and stuff. There's. Uh, no, this is, is all Super Nintendo. Coat? Okay, that's Are any of the consoles tested? Uh, is this tested? Yeah, all the tested. Most of the stuff is tested. Uh, the, the drums and stuff. Gotcha. Gotcha. And here's another uh, 360 game. Okay. We had that one in a bundle. Gotcha. My pal. Hey, if we can pull the box, those uh, right here in the black coat, huh? pull those up and see if you can send it to the box. What, like NES games? Yeah. Uh, oh, it looks like it's gonna be this, this. Yeah, no, nah, it's all it's all this stuff. Yeah, it's all this stuff. That's three uh, Resident Evil games on top. They have knocked off like crazy. Yeah. But it might be a market for them. I know when we do one. Oh yeah, they are fake. Yeah. Holy crap. They but, take his own. Yeah. They're all they're PS2. Yeah. But it's in a PS3 case. But when I looked it up, there is no Resident Evil 2 on PS3. PS3. Is it there one on PS3? The, really? Oh. Yeah. So I don't know. Huh. There's yeah. another one in Yeah, you're right though. This thing's a fake, ain't it? Yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Okay. All right, you guys, so I'm gonna put a pause to that video real quick, like, because it's kind of a perfect opportunity to do this. Um, and we will get into further more of the negotiation and all that here in just a sec. Um, but majority of that stuff that you guys have that you guys have already seen, and you guys will see more of it. Uh, majority of it is going to be in my upcoming whatnot auction. And just to kind of show you guys, like this is a lot of stuff: PS3 games, PS2, uh, Xbox 360. There's some Xbox Ones here, um, PS4, Super Nintendo. You know all types of stuff from just that deal alone we even added uh the consoles if you guys remember my last video i told you guys i was going to um test all the consoles well guess what uh pretty much everything worked exception of like i think the xbox one that i got from them uh for some reason it powers up and then it powers down i don't know what's going on with that um but 
PS3s work. We got two of those plus that. This stack right here is stuff that does not work, I believe. Um, the Xbox 360 works, the Genesis works, that Genesis works. So all of this stuff is going in the whatnot auction amongst the two different Wii's that we ended up getting. And then of course comic books, we have Marvel cards, uh, baseball cards, all types of stuff. So if you guys are interested in the whatnot auction, go down to the description below and click that link to where you guys can be a part of this amazing show. Like I said, um, he definitely hooked us up. You guys will see the negotiation price here in just a sec. But some really, really, really good solid stuff. And um, I'm very excited to share this with you guys on whatnot. So hit that uh, that link in the description below. And don't forget to follow, bookmark the uh, whatnot auction. It's going to be next Monday, I believe the 25th of 2024 at 6 p.m. Eastern time. So hopefully I get to see you guys there. Let's get back into the video. Have you ever played Mario Paint? Mm -hmm. It's so fun. It's actually, it's actually fun. Uh-huh. How many followers you got on uh, subscribers you got on this? Getting close to 10,000. Okay. Getting close. I did a weird better deal. Okay, what's that? You promote this brand for me on YouTube. Okay. Gotcha. What what what's the what what is it? Is it like reselling or what, what are it's, we doing? We make our own stuff. We okay. have our own diffusers that are okay. diffusers, humidifiers, air purifiers, and aromatherapy. We have the fragrances for the house okay. and we have the fragrances for the body. All of our okay. stuff we make from raw materials, we get imported from Italy and Argentina. So none of our stuff is gonna smell like nobody else. And we guarantee it will outlast anything you're gonna get from Macy's, Dillard's, Belts, any of that. Because normally, I can't even get to it. But normally we there's a there's a raw material called benzo resin uh -huh. that goes in your fragrance. That you typically only get 0.1% of. Mm -hmm. We give you 0.5. Reason being that stuff is $230 a gram. But we wanna build a reliable, trustworthy brand that right. outlasts everything. Right. I got that all that on camera. Look at that. Y'all see that website right there? That right there. Y'all go to a perfectly pristine aroma.com. Y'all heard a man, and you can tell he was genuine about what he was saying because he didn't know he was on camera. I, I snuck that in there. <laughs> but I got you, man. Yeah, absolutely. All right, turn around, smile. Oh, yeah. Go take a picture as well. Off. Yeah, we'll throw that in the video. There we go. <laughs> yeah, no problem. I, hey, at the end of the day, we all got to help each other out. I, I wish more people would understand that. Everybody, everybody thinks it's a competition. Yeah, I mean, in, in a way, competition is good though. It is. But at the same time, it's like if I go out of business, I can sell you stuff. If you go out of business, you can sell it. And even if it ain't just out of business, it's right. some stuff that you. That's just like uh, I seen that Chase. Chase built a lot of, a lot, a lot of good yeah. relationships with people. Yeah. And he would get a bunch of stuff from collectors, mm -hmm. but he would go and trade off the stuff that is five to ten dollars or right. less to somebody and then go back and right. get a whole bunch of high price things. Yep. So why would you miss that opportunity of having yep. the, the the networking capability right. of dealing with somebody else? Exactly. Bring and, and the greatest thing is too, like just hypothetically, you never know if you'll blow up like yeah. millions of dollars and you're gonna be like, hey, I remember you and, and, and vice versa. Yeah. You know? be like, okay, well that's that's my good friend for right. the whole time. Yeah, I remember 10 years when I came to pieces to be yeah. <laughs> Exactly, that's the way it should be. Oh yeah, y'all brought up more stuff too. Mm -hmm. Oh goodness. Okay, so how about this? Uh huh. Just be fair with me. Yeah. yeah. Since you like the older stuff. Uh huh. I'm gonna pick some more stuff out too. We'll do a thousand for everything. You can go in the truck and look through there as far as some of the older stuff. Okay. Because there's still a lot of high price items in there. Okay. Just don't tell my mouth out when you go in there. <laughs> okay, gotcha. We can do that. Okay. I'd rather, I'm limited on space and I'm limited on tables. Right, right. So whatever you don't get, the stuff out of the unit that we got, okay. I don't even have out of it. So you'll be doing me a favor by taking all the games because I was going to put them face up. Right, and right. And that's taking a lot of space. Yeah. All right, so a thousand, is that with this stuff or just yeah, with, that stuff. with that stuff? And okay. Get, I say maybe four or five other items out of there that are here to do it. Okay. They got price tags like these on. Okay. Okay. And, um, you prefer Cash App or Venmo? Oh, Cash App. Cash App, okay. Please recount that so I know I'm not <laughs> screwing up on it. And what's that Cash App name? All right there, Perfectly Pristine Aroma. Hey, y'all uh, see that. Make sure y'all send him some money. He's a good dude. <laughs> to be honest, man, I really, I really just want the exposure, man, on that. 
it's Absolutely. Not even about the money because I'm trying to build something for the kids, man. I'm trying to build right. the brand. Right. Yeah. Look at you go. Absolutely. Hey, I, like I said, I respect one hustle to another. Trust me. I. They said it's sent. If you want to double check it. I trust. Okay. All these two. Yeah, everything. Every video game related. We we said the drum sets too, right? The guitar, okay. And then. Oh, you ain't gotta do that, man. Don't sure. Don't block my blessing. Man. Okay. All right. You're right. You're right. All right. That's one thing my mom and daddy told me. Say, hey, don't 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 back tell me you do what I say. Huh? Okay. I got you. I got you. I appreciate that, man. Thank you, thank you. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We drove it last night. Oh yeah. Definitely. How far you come from? Just Savannah. It's only two and a half hours. Not too bad. All right. Round two. Brand new. It's a uh, boat light. How much is that boat light? Boat light. Okay. Okay. So this is the stuff you give me. Or you just want me to look at. That's what I want you to look at. Okay. So make sure. Eighty. And this. That is. Oh yeah. Gaming, but I just sold one. I didn't know I had another one. I sold one on eBay for like. What did that one sell for? Seventy or eighty? Yeah. Search light. Is this included with the gaming stuff? Or you want me to buy it separate? I, I, what did I tell you? Gaming? I, I mean, gaming, yeah, gaming, but you know. I, I already said that I got to keep my word. I wanted to charge, I did, but I, I got to keep my word. I, I mean, I want to be fair too, you know? It's, it's, uh, you sure? I gave you my word already. Yeah, but... You know, I mean, I mean, I get it. Words were, but you also, like you said, you blessed me with some Pokemon cards. Well, what would you charge if I was to buy it? Ten dollars. Okay, let's <laughs> let's do it. Let's do it. What about this? I'll, uh, I'll I'll gamble on this. It looks more like a Chinese type thing, like where it's imported from China. There's no specific brand. I probably want twenty, but ten. Box in that condition, go. Okay, appreciate that. And like I said, I'll keep looking. I'm I'm gonna fill up my bag over here with some of that loose stuff. And then uh, just be like, hey, pay me this price. I got it. Got it? Cool. Um, this one's a little outdated too. Okay. They don't they don't sell too well on okay. eBay. There's like a 2200 list and zero sold. <laughs> so, <laughs> so <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, these are only like two bucks a piece. Or actually, hold on. Bring that over here if you can. Oh, we also forgot this. <clears throat> we forgot these. <laughs> Thank you. I think I'm good on that one. What's the damage for all this? Uh, we're at 20 for those two other things. So I put them in my truck. Okay. So we're already at 20. And then a little bit, a little bit more goodies. What you, what you think you're gonna be able to get off? Of? Uh, fifty for this. If it's, I mean, it, look, it looks brand new, but I, I can't tell if that was resealed or not. But it, it should be brand, should be brand new. new. Okay, so yeah, I, I would get fifty out of that. Okay. Um, and the Celtic rate's pretty decent on it. So what, for the whole bag, what you think you'll be able to recoup out of? Oh yeah, those are well, those are two dollars a piece. Yeah, so that'd be eight dollars. So we're at twenty-eight dollars. Okay. Um, I don't know what you think. Let's do it even 40. 40 for those two? All right, 40 bucks. I appreciate that, man. Absolutely. I appreciate that. Y'all were wonderful. Yeah, absolutely. Took all my money. I just understand the <laughs> yeah. reseller, man. Yeah, no, I appreciate it. This will keep me busy for a little while. <laughs> but I will say, I'm, I'm pretty quick at getting stuff online, though. I'm pretty quick. Uh, <clears throat> hear that? Yeah, I appreciate it, y'all. No problem. Yeah, y'all, yeah. Huh? 
No, no, we're good. We appreciate y'all. Thank y'all. Yeah, y'all are awesome. Thank you. Know what you find in the other games that you don't really think you can use, mm -hmm. but it might be something for me. Okay. I don't know if you deal with Atari or anything. I mean, I deal with a little bit of everything. Okay. A little so bit of everything. Matter of fact, if you, uh, if you look at my backpack, that top zipper, very, very top, I got a business card in there. If you want, just shoot me a little text and just shoot me like your name and I'll, and I'll put you in my, my phone. Gotcha, man. <laughs> yeah, y'all yeah, have a good one. All right, you guys, now that is going to be the end of the video. Now, I know there was a lot, a lot, a lot of stuff going on. Um, you know, originally, he didn't really want to sell me all the video games because it draws a bunch of attention. Understandable, this is only the third stop, so it probably had to have been probably a little before 8 o'clock in the morning because we were out there at 7. And um, But overall, we were talking and talking and talking. His name is Trey, by the way. He's a very, very cool dude. Um, he's a hustler just like us. You know, we're out there finding that good stuff and then trying to resell it. Uh, and he's, you also tell he's a hustler too, man, because of, because of a few reasons. One, he he, he got a thousand forty out of me, good, right? Thousand dollars. Anybody who gets a thousand dollars in a day is, is pretty good in my book. On top of that, he got free labor, right? I helped him out with some stuff coming out of the uh, U-Haul, which again I didn't mind helping. Uh, but also too, he has his own little side business. You know, I told you guys to go to his website. Make sure you guys go check him out. Uh, send him send him a tip through Cash App. You guys saw that as well. Um, if you guys want to totally up to you guys but whenever he was talking about his business you could tell he had that genuine voice to where he is proud of what he what he represents what he's putting his time and energy into and money into right um so if you guys want to support him i, I highly recommend do it uh because overall he was a great great guy great hustler and uh overall just a great dealer in general so let's go ahead and talk about the stuff oh excuse me the stuff that we got so um, I know in the video he said there's about there's over 500 games. Maybe there's a box missing. Maybe two boxes. I'm not too sure. Uh, we ended up counting all the games. So it was 404 dollars. Okay. So let's just say a thousand dollars for all of the video game stuff, though. I mean that's everything. Okay. That's the consoles. It was um, all the video game stuff. The whole box of accessories. I mean because there's a bunch of PS4 controllers. There was some good good money there. Um, now. In this video, I don't really have the whole breakdown because I'm still in the middle of kind of uh, going through everything and I haven't tested out the drum sets, I haven't listed those, I haven't cleaned them, you know, that type of stuff. Also a few other handful of like guitars and uh, the two Pokemon um, uh, boxes that he gave me. I might actually end up keeping those because it was a gift from him. <laughs> so uh, very nice of him to do that as well. Uh, so I don't have a full breakdown, but let's just talk hypothetically here we paid a thousand forty for everything that was a lot of the craftsman new old stock we did sell one of the craftsman batteries and chargers for forty five dollars alone um there were some very very good pieces in there but a thousand and forty let's just say a thousand forty for all the video games let's not even include the craftsman stuff at 404 video games that's two dollars and some change per game right and in, in, in per console like I mean, it's pretty pretty awesome stuff that is a great deal now i will say there was a handful of games that were actually pretty solid anything that's twenty dollars above i think is pretty solid uh there was a uh, i think a couple one hundred dollar plus games i think one of them already sold for a hundred and we have one of them up, up there for 120 uh and you know the rest of the games you know we're gonna go anywhere between you know five to fifteen you know around that range and uh but there's some very very good solid stuff there and uh all the consoles worked uh exception i believe of the xbox one for some reason i don't know maybe it's power brick who knows i don't know whenever i tested it it's just the way it is however he was a man of his word i mean he he said all, all the consoles were tested he said he wasn't sure i believe on the sega genesis but they did work uh but he said he did not test the drums and i haven't done that yet uh so peaches and beaches again was uh, about two going on 10 days ago maybe 12 days ago somewhere around there and um we we've been trying to get stuff listed I'm, i've been trying i'm working on this private pick stuff that i did as you guys kind of see behind me i got stuff laying on the ground uh so it's just a lot of moving parts right now so um but with that being said a thousand and forty i mean even if we got five dollars per game let's just assume right let's say five dollars per game 404 uh you know video games that's over two grand so we we would at least double up our money right there but that's not including the consoles either right uh, so that's so that's talking about a bare minimum, and then of course we have uh, all the rest of the craftsman stuff, um, as, as well as some other things. But that was a great, great deal for a thousand and forty. I'm just assuming between everything. I think after all said and done, I think we're gonna make right around three, 
maybe maybe more than a little, little more than three grand now that's what i'm hoping for which i think we would definitely get that but uh, overall great experience great time great conversations that's why i kept that stuff in the video for the longest time it was just an honestly just such a such a great stop and uh such a it gave me such a high for the rest of the morning if that makes sense you know that the conversation is just, i love dealing with very very nice positive people it just makes my mood 10 times better than what it normally is <laughs> so um with that being said, please hit that subscribe button. Please hit that like button. Come join us over on Whatnot next Monday uh, so you guys can get some of these uh, video game goodies. And, um, yeah, we're going to keep hustling. Make sure you guys go check out Trey and his website, and we will uh, see you guys next video. We appreciate you guys. Much love. It's your boy, Georgia Picker. Peace. I don't wanna wake up.